Is it working? Oh. Yep, it okay. is. Okay, so this is the home on Sunnyside that we're talking about that has major problems. This is the laundry room, which is not finished at all. Contractor ran off with 50,000 bucks. Thought you might really want to get up there and see the electrical. That's gross and nasty up there. It's originally the tub and, or the tube and, oh shoot, probably call that knob and tube uh, wiring, which is now being traded out. There's no electrical panel in the house. It's been ripped out. Uh, at least I can't find it. Oh, sorry, falling. Okay. You can check out the four lane road. Tell them the problem with that. Uh, well, when they decided to put in the four lane highway, right here used to be the entrance to their garage, which has been now removed. Well, it doesn't have access to their garage. So the garage door is now facing the wrong way. They have to come in through their backyard to park. <laughs> exactly, and around. Uh, um, check out the kitchen. Yep. This is supposed to be a kitchen. Um, there is no kitchen. There needs to be a kitchen. There's no wiring. There's wires just dangling. The wires are not connected anywhere. They're run wrong, and they're just strung throughout the house. Yet they finished the ceiling, they painted it, and it's going to be a disaster to try to fix. There's no railing on the stairs. Stairs are way out of code. Can you put your foot on there without, uh, I don't know if you can see that, but that's like a three inch gap. And uh, no railing, that's very scary, off code. Here's bathrooms that are not finished. Definitely have no seats here. They're been ripped out. There is a toilet. That's the only thing they got bathrooms got going for it. The tub insert has got not finished. It's in, but it's not grouted. There's no fixtures. It's just not a done bathroom. And the master bedroom has had its closets ripped out and removed. What might have been a custom closet is now a big eyesore and uh, just a big problem. So. Uh, not good. Not good. We can go upstairs. Let's watch your step. This is kind of weird. <laughs> it's called treacherous. <laughs> watch your step when you get up here. Don't uh, go off the edge. Uh, yeah, note that there's no railing. <laughs> the floor also slopes, which you probably can't see, but ouch, it goes up. And then back down, it's just all warped and off-center. These walls also are bowed. The whole thing's not good. I mean, it's livable, but it's just out of repair. Here's another bathroom that has no bathroom in it. Our lovely shower. Watch your step when you're looking. Backyard. Here show it is. Going now. The backyard, it's a big mud pit now with weeds and everything else. Here's the garage. As you can see, that it does not have the garage door facing in the right direction. They don't have access to that anymore. Should I go show them the basement real quick? Yeah. The foundation. Watch your step. <laughs> do you want to go down there or do you want me to go down there? Um, I, I will brave it. <laughs> okay, you go first with the flashlight, though. <laughs> <laughs> Flashlight's running out of light. Let's see, at least get the foundation before the light dies. Okay. Here is our foundation, some nice rocks and dirt. Old style foundation. It's just rocks stacked together with dirt. Um, and then they painted it. Yeah, Anyways, want to give me further? Yeah, go around the corner. There's our foundation. I'm gonna go around that side and that's personally that to me would be scary as Just, you see the holes yep full of holes and no electrical panel it's been ripped out so don't know how it anyway 
Anything else you'd like to add? As you can see, it's definitely, as Ginger said, the only person that's gonna buy this and sell it is gonna be an investor that's willing to come in here and put the money into this home to finish it up. No one can move in here and get a loan. It's not inhabitable. And it also sits in a commercial overlay zone. So this is a residential home in, uh, on a four lane highway that is not zoned anything. It's kind of in a commercial overlay and it's just kind of stuck. And it's a problem. Definitely not worth the $90,000. It could be worth $90,000 after it's fixed. 